searching for a poem for Good Friday, I could only think of this one, another poem by John Donne, inspired by the fact that he was riding westwards on Good Friday uh, with his face to the west, uh, rather than looking east towards the Holy Land where Christ had died. And he reflects on how he may have turned away from this because of his sin, but hopes and prays that he may turn back. Good Friday, 1613, riding westward. Let man's soul be a sphere, and then in this, the intelligence that moves, devotion is. And as the other spheres, by being grown subject to foreign motions, lose their own, and being by others hurried every day, scarce in a year their natural form obey. Pleasure or business, so our souls admit, for their first mover, and our world by it. Hence is it that I am carried towards the west this day, when my soul's form bends toward the east. There I should see a sun by rising set, and by that setting endless day beget. But that Christ on this cross did rise and fall, sin had eternally benighted all. Yet dare I almost be glad I do not see that spectacle of too much weight for me. Who sees God's face, that his self, life, must die? What a death were it then, to see God die! It made his own lieutenant nature shrink, it made his footstool crack and the sun wink. Could I behold those hands which span the poles, and tune all spheres at once, pierced with those holes? Could I behold that endless height which is zenith to us, and to our antipodes humbled below us, or that blood which is the seat of all our souls, if not of his, make dirt of dust, or that flesh which was worn by God for his apparel, ragged and torn? If on these things I durst not look, durst I upon his miserable mother cast mine eye, who was God's partner here, and furnished thus half of that sacrifice which ransomed us. Though these things, as I ride, be from mine eye, they are present yet unto my memory. For that looks towards them, and thou lookst towards me, O Saviour, as thou hangst upon the tree. I turn my back to thee, but to receive corrections, till thy mercies bid thee leave. O oh, think me worth thine anger, punish me, burn off my rusts and my deformity, restore thine image, so much by thy grace, that thou mayest know me, and I'll turn my face. <laughs>